Hello third grade parents and students, I'm making this video to show you two of the greatest math programs you can use in third grade. Let's start with the fun one first. So the, uh, one of the funnest one is Prodigy. Prodigy is like when you take Pokemon and you mash together with Wizard and Adventures and throw math in, that's Prodigy. So Prodigy is free to play. I have my own class code set up that kids can join. This is my class code. That's a zero right there between the B's. So this one, you and your child can make themselves. They can make their own. I make it this way. That way you can make your own login info and keep it. So we're going to go to play.prodigygame.com. All right. So then we will go to sign up since this is a new profile. Alright, let me clear my past stuff out of here. Alright, so I'm going to go with Bruce Banner, Bruce B, and I'll make my password Hulk. Don't share your passwords. Alright, so you want to make sure to write this down after it's made. It'll give you your username and it'll give you your password. You choose whatever you password you want, okay? So make sure you write this down. Then you're going to hit done. Ask your teacher for the class code and type it here. Okay, so when it says class code, this is the code that you use right here. I'll also send this document in case you want to copy and paste off of this. Should be able to copy and paste. Well, thought I would be able to. All right, so it's E86B0BA. All right, and you, you don't have to uppercase it. I'll uppercase it for you automatically. So you'll hit next. What does your wizard look like? And then you'll be able to start making your own wizard and character from there. And this is great. Um, when it comes to like time for end of year testing, I can even like I can program it to give like test questions similar to those on the end of year testing in South Carolina. All everything on here is South Carolina based standards. Uh, there is a paid version of this where you can unlock more stuff and like. Students can evolve their creatures that they capture and stuff, um, but that's something parents can look into. But it is completely free to play. My daughter uses this every single day. All right, so let's look at the next one. The next one's extra math. I cannot recommend extra math enough. It needs to be done at least one time a day. The greatest thing about extra math is it's only 10 minutes long. That's all it takes to do. Um, third grade will be started on addition facts. It'll move once they get that certificate there. It'll move to subtraction, multiplication, and then division. I cannot stress it enough how important it is that students have the knowledge of these right off the top of their head. This program will help them to start getting these facts within under. A, I think they have to get in under six seconds. Okay, so they have to master all those before they can move on to like subtraction and then multiplication. But it is an excellent program. You'll go to this website here where you're going to be enrolling. So if you're on just a regular extra map website, you're going to click over here to the button that says enroll. All right. And from here, you will put in your email as a parent and the enrollment code shown here. Now, I can't show you how to go through all the steps of this because I don't have I, I don't have like I can't use my own email address to make this. Um, but it should if you have any issues with it, you just let me know. Every child, I've set up a, uh, an account for every child in here, and their password will be the four-digit month and their day of birth, okay? So, for example, if you're born March 15th, your password is 0315, okay? Um, now, there is an option. Now, this is what I do with my own kid. As a parent, if you want to be able to control everything yourself, you can create a family account. I highly recommend that. Um, as a parent, it would be great for you to be able to see um, when they complete their sets of addition, subtraction, multiplication, and also you can print off certificates each time they do it. So I highly recommend actually setting up your own account, but 
If you have issues with te technology, I've already has accounts set up, and all you gotta do is provide an email and that code. Okay, so these are two account. These are two programs I highly recommend for third grade. I actually recommend for third, fourth, and fifth. But I know third grade is new to some of this, so I wanted to make a video showing how to access this and how to log in and create these accounts. And I'll send this to students also who are interested in making it. But like I said, these are great to use every single day, and I have accounts for everybody. All right, thank you. I hope everyone has a great day.